the mysterious case of a whale skull found in Brewster. Next. Cape Cast. A back of a large whale skull was unearthed uh, by the staff at uh, Ocean Edge Resort. Uh, they originally found this, thought it was a rock. Uh, they started digging around it, found it was much larger than that. Luckily they called us and uh, we came down and we've been excavating it to try to figure out what we're dealing with. Uh, it's very fragile, so we're, we're having to take a lot of care because uh, uh, the parts that we're getting to below um, were exposed to water and so the bone is, is almost like uh, clay. It's coming apart on these lower sections, so we're just having to take a lot of care. And Right now we're trying to dig around it very carefully and let it um, expose to the air and not the sun, so that's part of the reason for the tarp. So that way um, the, the bone will harden. What we want to do is, once it does dry, um, we'll work with other researchers to actually drill in. We're going to try to extract DNA uh, from it we'll be able to tell species of the animal and also potentially figure out how old this animal could have been. So we'll hopefully get a, a little bit more history on this uh, mystery on Cape Cod. And if it is a right whale, does that mean there's a bigger sort of data bank of information about right whales because of all the concern about them? Yeah, that's a great question. There's actually a, a very extensive, uh, basically genetic uh, bank of right whales. And so, um, you know, if this animal is an animal from uh, this population, there's a good chance that if they are able to extract DNA, that maybe it will get matched up to some of the right whales that uh, you know that we currently have uh, visiting us in the wintertime. Cape Cast. Um, yeah, so as you can see, pieces do uh, come off quite easily right at the water line. So we're just. What do you have there? Uh, it's just uh, part of the occipital lobe. Oh, 